What's up guys? It's me, Sir Ernest, and today we're going to solve a problem regarding current displacement or displacement current. The problem reads, find the displacement current density associated with this magnetic field for a non-conducting medium. So as you will notice that this magnetic field is the magnetic field H, not the magnetic field B in vacuum. So here we're going, we're considering the Maxwell's equation in medium. Now, from the Ampere Maxwell's equation uh, in, in medium, we have the curl of H is equal to the free current F, JF, plus the derivative of the displacement uh, uh, electric displacement D with respect to time. Okay, so from the equation of the magnetic field H, you can see that it only has two components. It has, a, and it has an X component and a Z component. So our X component is a function of X, Z, and time. Okay, and the direction is x hat on the other hand the z component is a function of x z and t as well and this is along the direction of z okay also it's mentioned here that the medium that we're, con we're, we're considering is non-conducting so this means that the free current is zero Okay, because there is no conduction in the medium. So there is no free conduction or free current. So therefore, this equation is now reduced to uh, the derivative uh, the curl of H. And this is equal to the derivative of D with respect to time. Which is your displacement current, JD. Okay. So all we need to do is to just to get is to get the curl of H. So what is the curl of H? Okay? So in Cartesian coordinate system, this curl is simple. This is derivative of the Z component of H with respect to Y minus derivative of the Y component with respect to Z X hat plus derivative of H x component with respect to z minus derivative of the z component with respect to x y hat plus derivative of h uh, the y component with respect to x minus derivative of h respect to x with respect to uh, with respect to y z hat so from our setup earlier you can see that there is no y component okay so this term and this term will cancel also the x and z components doesn't have a y uh, doesn't have a dependence on the y coordinate so that means all partial derivatives with respect to y is also cancelled okay so now we are now left with this equation now the derivative of the x component with respect to z so this is your x component with respect to z so that is equal to uh, a mm, a1 b a beta negative then negative because this is cosine so this is sine 4x sine omega t minus beta z minus negative beta so that's plus uh sorry with respect to z uh, x so that means negative of negative 4 a2 sine 4 x times sine omega t minus bz then 
y hat. So therefore, the displacement current density, JD, is just simply equal to beta A1 plus 4 E2 times sine 4x times sine omega t minus beta c y hat. So this is the result or the answer to our problem. Okay, and this is the magnetic display or the displacement current associated with this magnetic field in a non-conducting medium. Simple, right? Okay. So no problem? Okay. So that's all for now. Thank you for watching. And then we will have additional problems in the next videos. Okay, but for now, uh, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.